Good morning, everyone. First thing I gotta say here is I gotta say sorry to some people because, you know, my whole journey has been like finding the truth out about stuff, right? So you always are finding out you're wrong about something. <laughs> so, but this was something that God showed me and so I have to, you know, I know that faith alone and Jesus alone is the truth. And, uh, but here I was thinking the whole time and telling people how to be saved or whatever that you had to ask God into your heart, you know, you had to do a certain prayer or something or and then it, and then after that it was faith alone and Jesus alone. Well, that's not because there's only one spot in the Bible in Romans that even talks about, you know, where it says if thou shalt confess with thy mouth, you shall be saved. It's the only part in the whole Bible that talks about anything about your mouth or about anything, but every single other thing in the Bible goes right along with John 3.16. God so loved a, his only begotten, or gave his only begotten son for, you know, the world. Died on the cross for us. And if you shall believe in that, then you shall be saved. It's all about belief. It ain't got nothing to do with works. It's about belief. Believe in Jesus' blood. Because it's all about blood. This is why I was thinking about, I was thinking about that blood over intent thing again. And all it is, is if you've ever read anything of uh, Aleister Crowley's, which all these people, it's like their God because he called himself the Beast 666, you know. And he taught the, sorry, uh, the Satanic Law of Reversal. And so we have been taught the Satanic Law of Reversal on everything since we've been born. And uh, and that goes right along with the blood, like with the blood over intent thing. That, uh, you know, you're thinking that you're going to do something with your blood. Well, how about believe in Jesus' blood and not your own? And then see what happens. If you think that you are so spiritually moved by doing blood over intent and saying that you intend to bring heaven to earth... Which is totally ridiculous. That, but you think you're doing it with your own blood? Jesus is doing it. He's gonna do it, and he's coming to take care of all these wiccans and all these liars. So I just wanted to tell you guys about that because I feel bad that I was ever telling people that. So. So I'm going to take down a few of the videos that I did today on telling people how to be saved and I'll have to make some new ones or something, but thanks everybody for listening to me and I will talk to you guys later.